So, I've been neglecting my passion project, and since it'll also let me murder a bunch of bugs, I think it's time I fix that. But first, I just need a couple of things. And actually, give me you. I used a lot of crude rope setting up some automatic food traps. So, time to make all of these, spin me some more. Hooray for the lazy man's labor. There is truly nothing better. All right, going down. Come on, buddy. I already know you guys are going to be annoying. I just want a little bit of grass, and every time you guys just get in my way trying to bite my butt for some reason, Reason. I don't know what the sick obsession is. Is it thick? Yeah. Huh? Is it perfectly sculpted by Michelangelo himself? Of course. Does that mean you can bite it and kill me? No. I didn't think I'd have to write that one down for you guys, if we're being honest. Green shield bug alive over here somewhere too. Yeah, there you are. You're my least favorite one of all. Get away from the roly poly. I will not kill him until I have to. Huh? Wait, what? Would you quit running from me? Get over here. You stupid green insect. Oh, here you go. Using your stupid boinging technique on me. That's fine. No, that's fine. We can hash this out. How do you still have the capabilities to do that? <laughs> when will that get taken away from you? Grounded dev, please nerf green shield bug. Thanks, I'm Cade. Actually, I just got reminded of something too. You guys left numerous, and I mean numerous, comments telling me that I'm a big, stupid, dumb, dumb idiot. And not only did I cry, but I wept. Anyways, I've been told that this sour axe can actually do the job of my termite axe, but better, as the termite axe takes two hits and then a third to drop another. But I was told that this sour axe can... Okay, well, that also took two hits. I don't, this isn't feeling any any quicker. Suddenly, I'm starting to think you guys lied to me, and everyone just wanted to make fun of me in the comments, and no one really wanted to help. Or maybe I'm doing it wrong. Who knows? All right, two plank pallets coming on up. Only there was a way to carry grass better. Try to make my life just at least one-tenth easier. Right? What if I throw the sour axe? Is that- Wow. That didn't accomplish anything. Alright, I don't think I need too much grass. Come on, we'll just go up a two. It's been a while since I've done my own manual labor. Maybe I should place that Craigslist ad again. One pallet down. I immediately want to make those stairs before I forget. And the- Yeah, yeet. I'm coming, my secondary pallet. Do not think I forgot about you just because you're number two. And I can't pick it up, and I have to kill a man. Man, that plot really developed fast, huh? I got- hit while I was moving this, and I thought that was supposed to cancel me moving the blueprint, but I guess it bugged out and I'm safe. And the devs, please don't change that. Second plank pallet, down. Can I finally complete my floor now, please? <laughs> Thank you. Oh, it's... <sighs> I forgot about all of that. Hang on. I think I've got some leftover free labor up here. Is there anything else I can do with this? What if I made a bridge that went all the way across the yard? Oh, and what do you know? I had a lot. And smack, fix this up. Nice and neat, please. Thank you. And I'm one weed stem short. All right, well. Also, I decided on at least a little bit for the signs here. There a B and an A somewhere in this? You know what? Early access, and then this tombstone will have to work. Oh, I forgot I needed grass planks for these dressers and crude rope. Hey, are you guys done spinning? At least part of you has to be done. And smack, and smack. And now these are actually storage containers too. What I would want to store in them, I don't know. I think the important fact is that I can. Also, Chuck this chest over here because I think it said these things need acorn tops and I have plenty of those. I probably still need some more light in here though. Everything gotta be so dark and why is this red and scary? If I build a lamp on the Black Widow's butt, does that? Oh yeah, that's ominous. There we go, and everything looks homey and definitely not like a weird murder cult. Huh? All right, I'll run up the stupid stems to get more ween stems. There, you happy? You forced me to do cardio game, is that what you wanted? No one wants to do cardio ever. A new morning full of opportunity and a bunch of aphids I can now eat. I gotta admit, I feel like there's supposed to be more signed markers in the game and that's whenever I remembered I can take a trip to my good buddy Burgle. Do not worry my four foot two robotic friend. That's centimeters by the way. I'm on my way. Also, did these work at all while I was gone? There was nothing in the aphids and it, oh, uh, I guess a weevil died here. That's fine. It's like passive income. I can just forget about it and hope it works. Burgle, my dear, I am here. Rhyming on accident. I see you. Oh, wow. That's that's a lot in here. What is the Oh, a dog. Give me it. Can I buy like all of these by chance? No. Despite doing everything in the game, I'm still 8,000 raw science short. All right. Note to self. Maybe do a quest or two for Burgle from this point forward because you never know what I'll need to unlock with raw science. Man, now I gotta walk all the way back. Actually, wait, before I do, I've had a question for the longest time and still no answer. When you open up this little hatch underneath the bird bath, you can swim in and it takes you to a locked door. Wait, 
What? It needs a card. What card? Oh, huh. Well, looks like I've solved my own question. Is there anything cool in here? Just a couple of quartzite shards? Lily pad wax? Gross. I'll take it. Give, give me, give me. This is so hard to grab. How am I supposed to grab the ones off the top? Sh oh, I guess like this. Didn't realize I had extendable arms. That's my bad. Well, I guess I could have opened this a long, long time ago. Is there anything inside of here by chance? <laughs> is this quartzite shard studying facility? All right. Is that mushroom talking? Who, uh, what is that? All right. Time to never worry about this place again. I t move, move, move. I'm stuck. The tadpole just tried to waterboard me. Well, not so much as waterboard, just straight up drown and murder me. And you know, I can respect that. When did so many bugs respawn over here? Didn't I just kill you guys? Not a day goes by in my life when I'm not plagued with a perilous situation where one mistake means inevitable death. Also, not a day goes by ungrounded when I have to fight bugs. Think about it. And now I am back from my excursion with the ability to buy a lot more signs like this one of a frog firefly hybrid twerking? I, I don't know why I bought that. Hello, doggy. But now with all these lovely new additions, this place is actually looking pretty cool in here. Hooray for interior design. And now that I've spruced up the bottom, I think the top could use a little bit more work. Specifically, something along the lines of that then right there. Does that work? Yes, jump. Because since I'm making the boss floor or enemies that are just tough to beat floor, of course I have to include the moth. Come on, get the exhibit set. I'm just out of crude rope and sprigs, I guess. What's going on? Come here. How can I be out of materials? All I do all day is grind materials. Someone's about to get fired, I think. Crude rope's done, and moth. Well, I'm gonna have to kill a couple of those guys, aren't I? Also, thanks to my research, I've got triangle stem walls, so I can make this not look stupid. Hooray Woo! for scientific advancement. I need one more moth scale and two more moth fuzz. That's fine and all, but I kinda wanted to mark out spots for other creatures, because, I mean, let's face it, there is a lot of them. We're doing, like, two stuffed infected larva. Thank you and thank you. Facing off against a stuffed ladybird. Truly a tale as old as time. Who told that tale? I have no idea. The tale is as old as time. I was not alive. And let's get some stuffed infected mites down, along with a stuffed weevil. Thank you. Oh, we're gonna have to kill some more of those guys. That's fine. And then a very grim sight, but the stuffed infected ladybug. Oh, my lady, I'm sorry what they did to you. Whoa, her eyes still move. That's both trippy and pretty cool. This is like the meeting of an infected mob boss with her little henchmen and then the cronies. Oh my god, I did not mean to do that. I wanted to zoom in. That's fine. Everything's fine. So what do I need to kill some weevils and then to kill a lot of mites? That's achievable. And then eventually to kill a few more moths. Is this exhibit in a weird shape? Nah, probably imagining it. All right, murder victims, prepare yourself. Well, as much as one can before they become a murder victim. Victim A, Mr. Weevil, you've been murderized. And oh, your friend. Sweet. I already forgot how much raw weevil meat I needed, but that is fine. Two's probably enough. What's going on? There's a whole gang here. I was quite literally set up by an orc weaver junior, this bombardier jerk, and then a couple of fire ants. Did the mites hire some weird bodyguard system? Hey guys, your bodyguards failed. Now I get to murder you. That's how the law goes, right? Ooh, two for one. Killed an aphid on accident. Would you quit jumping away from me? Thanks. All of them are chasing after that one aphid. Guys, pay attention to me too. There we go. Now we're starting to get them. We've got 15 mite fuzz, but I think I need 17? I don't know. Here, shoot that guy. And then shoot that guy. Any other guys in my vision? I can... Oh yeah, that guy all the way over there. Got him. This buddy right through the leaf. Got him. Man, when did I get so good at this? 360. Oh, he jumped at me. Stupid jerk. Ruined my clip. Oh, this poor guy's stuck in the earth. What an idiot. Oh, he got out. Here I thought he was a helpless, weird little crab. Turns out it was an elaborate trap. And no, stink bug. No, no, no. Stop chasing after me. You're just like the green shield bugs and I hate you. Are you still chasing after me? Go away. Why is this guy so dead set on killing me? Hello, first house. I know I said I didn't know how many weevils I needed, but I've killed six of them. Sorry, scratch that. I've killed nine of them. What unfortunate passing they decided to take today. Oh. My lady. Oh, taking this stay well always brings back memories. Fun ones? No, just memories. No, that's the wrong zip line. Turn around, turn around. Make sure we take the right one. Thank you. Grounded. Whatever you want to throw on the second aphid, man. This was a three minute zip line, please. My dopamine receptors, my monkey brain, I need the activation. Also, infected mites and infected weevil set. I don't know whenever I'm going to need to make a weevil again, so I'm going to put raw meat and cooked meat in the same fridge next to each other. Trust me, I know every health rule in the book. All right, one more scale two moth fuzz. Sorry, buddy. I know I keep saying we have a truce and all, but I need you to die. I just didn't expect I would keep needing you to die. And that's actually, I'm low health now that I think about it. Don't mind me. He's taking good damage. Are you doing that wind thing to make me bleed? Yeah. 
Yeah, you are. Well, quit it. It hurts. Get shot in your eye socket. All right, die to poison or that arrow. Either one works for me. Oh man, I got three moth fuzz, but I didn't get a moth scale. Am I about to legitimately die to this bleeding real quick? Hang on. Hmm, let's pretend we didn't see that. Moth fuzz in. And what are the odds I can hit that moth that exists all the way over there? Or do we do we think I'm out of his range? Man. All right, fine. It's a new day. Give me my aphid meat. I've already murdered a bunch of people. What's wrong with murdering a bunch more? Why is he hovering like that? That was weird. Tiger mosquitoes do not see me. I hate fighting. Literally, what did I just say? Uh, whatever. Come on, everyone's getting poisoned. Reminder that you did this to yourself. I had nothing to do with it. There goes one of you dead. There goes two of you dead. Where'd, where'd the third go? Oh, dead too. You and years and years of warnings and they still don't listen. Well, this guy's sleeping, so I'm just gonna murder him before he gets a chance. Again, that's your fault for being in my way, not mine. Oh, can I have your body then? Yoink! <laughs> All right, I've got nine tries at this. Can I hit him? Nope, that one missed. They're a little lower. I don't know what that one did. And yeah, there we go. All it took was the jumping trick shot and just keep shooting him before you can get over here. How you doing, buddy? Well, you're parried, so now you're hopefully bleeding and poisoned. Something along those lines. No, 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 don't hit me with that. Or hit me with that. That's an option you have, I guess, if you wanted to do that. Hey, I, I need you over the thing. Parried, shoot him in his face. No, do not, do not back out of the arena. Do not back out of the arena. Oh, I was worried I was gonna lose my loot. Give me you. One moth scale. That's perfect. Let's get out of here. No, no more fighting. I'm done. I quit. I surrender. Only because I don't want to fight tiger mosquitoes for the next eight minutes. Not because I'm afraid of you guys. Just in case any of you were gonna write something in your blog. Oh good, the ox beetle's back. It's always gotta be something, doesn't it, game? That's fine. I've killed plenty of those guys. Do I have the golden ox beetle card, actually? Oh, I do. How difficult would it be to get the rest of the golden cards, do you think? I feel like the answer is, uh, very. But that is fine. After murdering, well, the peace treaty that I've had seven times over, the moth has been created. That is a giant face on its back, and this thing is scary. You know, I've, I've been fighting this thing every time. Gross. All right. What else should go on the upper floor now? 